crap, why am I doing this again? G'day guys, my name's Josh, you can call me Shawoodle, and welcome, oh fucking hell, welcome to Dungeon Nightmares 2, which is a game that I played uh, about two years ago, was the last time I played, I only played a little bit, and all I remember about it is it scared the absolute living shit out of me, that is the only memory I have of this thing, and even just looking at like the main menu screen, it's just freaking me the fuck out. Um, it's created, written, and designed by K-Monkey, who is a small-time developer on, uh, Steam Greenlight when I played it last time, and that's on Steam proper, so you can go get it and buy it for yourself and have your own shit scared out of you on your own, but I'm gonna play it because I don't, I don't know why this, uh, god damn it. Actually, you know, you know what I need? I need some Dutch curry. I'll be right back. All right, I was just gonna bring just one glass, but I figured that wouldn't do it for me, so I brought the whole bottle just in case, because this is... This is gonna absolutely kill me. Alright, there we go. Oh, fuck. Oh, that's good. Anyway, aside from me being a giant pussy, see how nervous I am? I like unsettling in my chair. Welcome to Dungeon Nightmares 2. New game. Oh, God, please don't kill me, game. I'm so fucking nervous. I, I don't want to do this at all. <laughs> I hate scary games so much. I want to just be playing, you know, fucking Minecraft or something. Something that's like nice and easy and not scary. And that would make me happy. That would make me much more happy what I'm doing now. Pover Nocturnus Night Terrors. This whole goddamn game's a night terror! What the shit? Oh, I've already jumped! I'm just fucking... I jumped when it just loaded the game! Fuck, this is gonna end so badly for me! Alright, M... M for map. Wait until you get off the elevator. No, give me the fucking map! I wanna see what is going on! Oh god, I've forgotten how shit this is. It's just a game, Josh. Can't actually hurt you. It's just a game. Alright. Cruising through, waiting for something to scare the fucking bejeebus out of me. Oh fuck, I hate this already, and I've gone approximately three feet. This is gonna be bad. Oh yeah, press C to spark a light. And it makes me blind temporarily straight after doing it. Oh fuck, okay. Oh, what's this? Alright, I seem to just be in my own little room. There's nothing here that can hurt me. I'm gonna have to- I have to get- What is it? Oh, fuck me! Um, yeah, I don't want to go down there, do I? I don't feel like I do. There's something over here. Is this- is this- what, what's this? Hello? Nope, can't see dick through there. Fuck! Come on! Is there like a crouch or something so I can like hide in the corner and just like get my wits about it? Just, uh, you know what? I'm pausing the game. Oh, fuck. Okay. Alright, here we go. Oh my god, I hate this. Oh. Oh, I remember you. I remember you, Steam Valve. You've scared the absolute fucking pants off me so many times. You gonna do it? You gonna do the thing? No, nope, you're not gonna do it. Well, that was a fucking waste of time. Normally they like explode and shoot Steam and make me weep all day and all night, but... For now, it seems to be okay. There's another one. Wait, is that the same way I just came? I'm getting all turned around. Yeah, I got- I actually got turned around by the mouse, mouse sensitivity. I'm going this way. Oh, come on! Fuck off, game! It's not even fair! I wasn't looking at anything! What is this? Do I need this? Well, it's- it's on now, whatever it was. I feel like that- I can hear something moving now and I'm scared. I've got- I've got so many goosebumps right now. You wouldn't even believe. Oh, there's a chest. What's in- oh, what's in the chest? Uh, what is there? Can I- can I pick it up, please? Got a candle and a chipped around the top goblet. Okay, that's fine. Um, now if I remember correctly, I press C to light the candle. B to blow out. Okay, B's a long way away from where my hand is. If I have to blow this candle out quickly, I'm gonna have a lot of trouble doing that. Oh! Oh, what's wrong with this? It was red. It wouldn't let me open the open the chest. I don't want to open that chest. I don't want to do it. I don't I don't want anything to do with it, but I have to. I know I have to. Oh come on, Josh. Man the fuck up, you big girl. Oh god, that's not, okay. Okay. I'm still I'm still fine. There's blood on the wall right here. Somebody died opening this chest. I knew it was a bad idea to open it. There wasn't even anything good in there. What the shit? Fuck this! This is getting right under my skin. The, the, the girl whimpering in my ear isn't doing me any favors either. I can't see fucking anything, and I hate this so- Fuck off, Steam Valve. Suck my dick, I'm not looking at you. 
I'm aware. I'm aware I'm going painfully slow for the especially for the first level where there's probably not gonna be anything that's gonna harm me too much. Uh nah, fuck fuck the chest. I'm just going up. I'm out of here. Turn the world to exit. Turning, turning, turning. Yeah, I where I'm going horribly, horribly slow. You wouldn't even believe how fucking petrified I am of all this shit. This is not my idea of a good time. I fucking hate this. All right, April 1st, 5.14 p.m., which is right now, funnily enough. You wouldn't even believe uh, that, that when the first time I saw that, I was like, oh my God, how does it know? But then I was, I was just fucking stupid. Anyway, uh, that is the day I'm recording this. This is like a big April Fool's joke on myself. Oh, God damn it, I hate this. Oh, that's, that's, almost, that's almost kind of music. That's all kind of nice. Can I just sit on the bed, listen to the rain outside, listen to the music? Can I, can I just be what I do for the episode? Please, pretty please, I beg of you, don't make me do this. Don't make me keep going. <laughs> That's clever. I like how he's got around having to give me like an actual character model by breaking into the mirror and saying that I can be, I can't really see myself. That is smart. Good job, K-Monkey. You've done that well. All right, out into the hall. Out being brave, pretending I'm not scared to death of anything that's in this thing. There's a rocking chair with a fucking teddy in it. I'm not going that way. Absolutely not. I'm going this way. I'm not quite sure what I'm meant to be doing, so I'm just going to go to these doors. That's I'm, I remember that's how you get to the next level, by going down the elevator. That's about all I remember. I, um, I can't run. I can't do anything up here. So I guess it's on to the next level where something will definitely eat my face. You guys honestly have no idea how much I hate doing this shit. This is fucking killing me. Like, even in, like, the quiet moments, my heart's just pounding through my goddamn chest. I can't handle this. Ah! Oh, good. There's just a little bit of blood on the walls, then. Nothing nothing too much to worry about. Christ's sake. Okay. What kind of basement is this? I don't know. A fucking nightmare basement, that's for sure. I should look around for clues about this place. Or you could just not. Why, why does everyone feel inclined to look for clues? Why would the fuck won't you just go to bed and listen to the radio? And the rain, like a goddamn set! Alright, I'm in the last little room all to myself. So I can kind of investigate this little area. And wait until the scotch hits my belly and makes me feel better. What the dick is that? This is like a picture frame of maggots. It's like a Harry Potter nightmare. Why is the picture moving? Stop it! The eye sockets are cracked. The eye sockets are cracked on the fucking skull. Uh, that's just a horrifying idea. Who would even think of that shit? I have some serious concerns about the, this game maker's... Like, does he even sleep at night? Like, what does he do at night time other than just dream up ways to make grown-ass men like me poo themselves? How? What do you do at night? Come on! Oh, enough with the fucking heartbeat. Come on, I'm not- I'm just- It's getting to my head. That is also getting to my head. Fuck off! I'm just walking aimlessly through a hallway. Please don't murder me, you son of a bitch. Where the fuck am I supposed to go? I'm gonna cry in a corner. All right, after wandering an awful long way around in basically a circle, God damn it! I have found another room. Oh God, I'm I'm nervous because I've seen like I've seen the trailer that he put out for this video. Not this video. This this fucking schoolgirl missing. Um. Okay, turn around. Search for missing girl 16 continues. A frantic search is underway for a missing 16 year old girl who disappeared over the weekend after setting off to visit a friend's house. She was last day walking, blah, 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 blah. Is there anything in here that actually matters to me? More sounds, not looking up. If something, if something jump scares me now and comes out to eat me, then I've, I've got nothing to do with it. I'm not dealing with that shit. I'm reading the fucking newspaper. Leave me alone. Why is it red? Why is it glow? fucking breathe for fuck's sake this the, the the sounds just get to me you know like just i'm trying to focus on shit and just the sounds this game is making is sending me right around the fucking twist fuck oh that is not okay that fucking voice was whispered i'm coming for you in my fuck why was it red why was it red i just whispered i'm coming for you in my fucking ear and i didn't like that whatsoever oh christ oh fuck me oh fuck me no don't do this it's a fucking dead end are you fucking kidding me i came all this way for a dead end please don't tell me this is like set up like doom or something where like i've just crossed an invisible line and now that's triggered something else in the world to be a thing that's gonna scare the dick out of me later please don't tell me that's how this game's set up 
because I don't need, I'm not looking forward to the rest of this fucking video. Oh my god, I just want to stop now. I've been going, I've been going for 20 minutes. I can make a video out of that, right? I can just, I can just stop now and everything will be okay. That'd be fine, right? No, 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 no. Stop it. Stop it! Oh, just please, let me find the exit, please, for the love of God, what the shit is that? Is that just skulls hanging in the middle of the fucking room? I'm gonna creep past this shit. Oh, don't touch it. Don't have a look at it. Just keep going. Sneak. <gasps> oh, fuck my- <laughs> Oh, I threw my headphones off in fear. Oh, I can't do this shit. <laughs> nah. Nah, I need- I need- I need some more. I can't- I can't do it. I can't handle it. I just- I just don't want to do this shit. I just really don't. Oh, come on, Josh. Get it together. Alright. Alright, I'm back into it. Why is the heartbeat still going even though I've paused the game? Fucking give me a break, game. Alright, which way was I going? I was going this way. Oh, oh my god. Was I going this way? Yeah, I was. Oh, fuck me. That little fucking girl. Eat a dick. And fuck off. That is not cool. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, come on! Fuck me. Fuck me, my heart's beating out my fucking goddamn chest. I don't want to do this anymore. I just want the exit. Just give me... Oh! Oh, get it together, Josh! Why is there a chest at the end of a long ass hallway? Why is that even a thing? Look how far away I fucking am! Just give me the goddamn exit game! Fuck you! Ah, oh, I got some candles. Good, I can use them for lights. Light it up. Light it up in here! Please don't show me anything scary! Alright, B. B for blow. Christ, it's so far fucking away from WASD. What? I'm just gonna slap the keyboard. I'm gonna smash it with my, my, my palm and hope to god I hit B to fucking blow this candle out. Cause something is gonna come for me and I am actually gonna have a heart attack. Fuck off with the whispering, not listening. Alright, you know what? You know what? New plan. New plan for all this. Okay, follow, uh, turn right. Keep turning right. I'm just sprinting through the rest of it. Fuck you, game. I'm brave, and I'm running, and I'm sprinting, and I'm going to get to the fucking exit! Run, 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 run. Keep turning right. Everything. Don't forget to save your stamina. Fuck off. I can't just run through this shit. Eat a dick. But they, they, they were on to me. They, they knew my plan. They knew I just wanted to get out of here quickly, and they just fucked me over. I can hear footsteps in here. Oh! 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 oh no! No, no! No! No, no, no! Fuck this! Fuck this so fucking hard! I just died! What the fuck was I heard the footsteps and I was like, no! No, fuck you! Fuck you, I'm not listening! You can eat a dick. Like, that's just another thing. It's just another audio cue that is fucking with my head. And I was like, fuck it, I'm brave. I'm going in anyway. And there was a fucking monster. It's not okay. Oh, fuck. Nah, 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 fuck it. My throat hurts. My throat hurts from screaming. And probably, uh, the alcohol's probably making, well, numbing it. It's probably making it okay. I'd probably be hoarse if I didn't have this. But really, fuck this so hard. That's fucking bullshit. I'm not dealing with that shit. Anyway, this is different. I don't remember it being this scary last one I played. Last one I played this, I was with people. And I had them to make me, like, not get drawn into the game and freak the fuck out. But, um, uh, now I'm by myself. Even with all the bright lights, it's still scaring the absolute tits out of my fucking nipples. My tit is going through my nipples. That's how fucking scared I am. Logic ceases to exist. What the fuck was that thing, though? Was it that... Was that the same thing that I saw when I flashed the light the first time? I was even thinking about talking about, as once I got around that corner, about what that thing was. It looked like a burn victim, and that, that lines up with that verse thing you hear when you load the game with, like, the people screaming and the fire. So, that might have something to do with it. But then, yeah, the fucking thing was, like, roaming around it and fucking ate me. Admittedly, I probably could have got away if I didn't freak the fuck out, drop everything, hide the ball on the floor over there, away, so you couldn't see me. Um, but then when I came back, I was still dying, I tried to run, and it was like, it was grabbing me, and I couldn't move. Fucking horrifying! This is awful! Anyway, after the sequential heart attacks I've just gone through, I think I am gonna leave this episode 
here. You know, I'm going to save and exit. Uh, I am going to leave this episode here. So thank you guys for watching. However, I'm not going to do the normal outro this time. In fact, no, I'm going to take these off. I'm not doing a normal outro this time because there's a very good reason why I decided to scare myself shitless and play this game again. And that is because someone told me that watching me play these games and watching myself, watching me shit myself, uh, gives them a lot of a lot of joy and a lot of pleasure. Now you would think that would make them sadistic as fuck, and I would agree normally. However, this particular person is going through a bit of a rough time, and when this video comes out, uh, just after this gets this uh, goes online, actually, she'll be going in for uh, some pretty serious stuff. And I, she, I was talking to her about it, and uh, I decided that I wanted to do this, especially for her, just to make her feel better on this awfully awful awful time and I, I i can't even appreciate what is what it would be like to go through because it's i mean i don't know everything about it but what i do know sounds pretty awful and um i don't know i feel like it's the least i can do to try and make her feel better so this goes out to you and i hope that you get through and i hope you don't lose uh your, your positive attitude because that's the, the worst thing that can happen to you you can get you can get o overcome by everything and that will just get you down in the dumps and make everything worse but from, from every time i've spoken to you about it you've been positive and I just want you to know that I hope you get through it. And so I guess I'll sign off with the eternal words of Yellow Card, which are very near and dear to my heart. Everything is going to be alright. Be strong. Believe. And for everyone else who's watching this video, have a good one.